And Samo Guinness' story leads us to a big question tonight in which we ask, are you confident that judicial reforms are on the right track? Are you confident that the judicial reforms are on the right track? Do text us a yes or no comment with a brief comment to the number uh, 22155, 22155. You can also tweet us at Kate and Kenya or at Betty Kialo and we'll sample your views during this newscast. To Mombasa now where police had a hard time calming down a section of residents following reports that a close associate of controversial cleric the late Sheikh Abu Rogo had been killed. Several businesses closed down and some people stayed away from the town as the rumors about the killing of Abu Bakar Sharif Makaburi and a son of the late cleric spread. But as KTN's Ferdinand Omondi reports, both the police and Makaburi had to come out to allay the fears. A usually calm city of Mombasa was shaking from within as rumors spread fast that Abu Bakar Sharif, also known as Makaburi, had been killed. Several youth had even reportedly planned a huge protest immediately after the Friday prayers. And the man in question, visibly alarmed and very much alive, called a swift conference to defuse the tension. Mimi na wambia vijana niko hai, hakuna haja kufanya fujo lolote, watu wakae kwa salama. The rumors and tension caught the attention of Mombasa security organ. Mombasa County Commissioner Nelson Marwa was furious. These individuals are hell-bent and they have ill motives to cause despondency to ensure that Kenyans in this county start fighting. Makaburi had close relations with the late Sheikh Abu Drogo, who was killed in a hail of bullets last year by unknown persons. His death elicited violent protests in Mombasa that lasted one week. Now, Makaburi is reading a conspiracy theory. I think uh, they are afraid of uh, the public's reaction if they kill me because of what happened uh, after Abu Drogo's death. So they wanted to see how will the public in Mombasa react. So they started rumors before doing whatever they want to do. However, security chiefs insist this was a plan of mischievous people. <laughs> We are aware of that and we are not going to sleep. Police are calling on the public to be extremely vigilant and to report any suspicious activity for immediate action. But they are also cautioning against spreading unfounded rumors warning that this might lead to arrest and prosecution. Ferdinand Mundi, KTN, Mombasa.